My name is Steve, and I have a passion for reptiles and amphibians. So much so, for the past 28 years, I've been injecting snake venom in order to build up an immunity. I just love snakes. I was born in, in California in, in 1966. We had moved to Connecticut, where I grew up. And I lived in the countryside. I mean, I, I lived on miles of dirt roads, and there were snakes everywhere, which was great for me. Så vitt Steve vet är han ensam i världen om att under så lång tid byggt upp sin egen immunitet mot ormgift. Steve är ju som en um, immuniserad kanin. Han har ju initierat sig med ormgift uh, under lång tid och har då uh, en relativt högre koncentration av de celler som gör något som kan neutralisera ormgiften. Han är också övertygad om att injicera ormgift är bra för hans hälsa och att det gör att han åldras långsammare. It was when I was like 17 years old. I just had this light bulb moment where I, I thought, okay, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to inject myself with snake venom and something good is going to come from it someday. The first time that I tried using snake venom, I could feel the fire burning sensation, and I remember I was quite frightened by that. You know, the next day it got really swollen, it was really swollen, and then left a horrific bruise. So I knew that even that small dose that I took was extremely potent. But I survived it, so I thought, I'll try that again. And it took me about four to five months before I did that again. You know, they know, oh, You see that? Steve fick samma resultat, hemsk smärta. Men efter att ha testat ytterligare några gånger började han märka en skillnad. I started noticing that I was recovering quicker and there would be less swelling time and less bruising more importantly. So after a couple of years of doing that, I, I proved to myself that it was possible to build up an immunity to snake venom. I could see with my own eyes that my you know, dangerous experiment was working. It's not a good snake to be bit by. I've been warned about these. <sighs> hey, 